Today we'll be performing a full Diesel Force EGR system cleaning service on this 2013 Peterbilt equipped with a Packard MX-13 engine. The vehicle was purchased used with approximately 150,000 miles and its history is relatively unknown. Our mechanics will be performing detailed inspections before and after the service to demonstrate the cleaning power of the Diesel Force EGR system cleaning service. The mechanics are removing the crossover tube and an intermediate pipe to gain access to the exhaust system. They will be sending an inspection scope into the engine so we can get a closer look at the current state of the admission systems. Here we see the outlet side of the EGR cooler. As you can see, all surfaces of the cooler are coated with a heavy layer of soot. Next, we'll get a view of the EGR valve, which is also coated. If this buildup worsens, it could easily result in loss of EGR valve operations. Moving through the EGR valve, we reach the inlet side of the EGR cooler. As this face receives incoming exhaust gas, it appears far dirtier than the outlet. If left uncleaned, the caked on soot will begin restricting airflow and inevitably plug the EGR cooler. With the engine systems inspected, our mechanics will move onto the exhaust canister. They will remove the canister from the vehicle and disassemble the individual components. This will allow inspection of the diesel oxidation catalyst, DOC, and the diesel particulate filter, DPF. To accurately gauge the reduction of particulate trapped in the DPF, the unit will be weighed before and after the completed Diesel Force EGR system cleaning service. Here we see a reading of 46 and a half pounds on a certified digital scale. Now that all pre-services inspections are completed, the mechanics are reassembling the exhaust components in preparation for the Diesel Force EGR system cleaning service. The first step of any Diesel Force service is to attach your shop scan tool and check for any system faults and codes. Our technician is now adding Diesel Force EGR systems cleaner to the Diesel Force emission system tool. Typically, the service requires two gallons of product to both the intake and exhaust side of the machine. This amount may vary slightly depending on engine models. Adding Diesel Force Diesel Injector Cleaner and Ultimate 11 fuel treatment to the fuel tank is required to ensure a complete cleaning of the engine. At this time, the technician is installing the MX-13 specific engine adapters. Both adapters and hoses are color-coded for easy identification. Black adapter and hose to the exhaust side blue adapter and hose to the intake side. Hoses attach via standard quick coupler fittings. By connecting the Diesel Force Special Engine Controller, the EGR valve and the VGT can be actuated during the Diesel Force EGR system cleaning service. This allows for an effective cleaning of all surfaces within these components. The technician has applied shop air to the Diesel Force Emission System tool, assuring pressure does not exceed 60 PSI, and initiated the Diesel Force Emission System cleaning. Product is administered through an atomizer, which creates a high density foam to powerfully scrub the entire system all the way to the DPF. Now that the initial cleaning is completed, the technician is attaching the differential pressure adapter. By running Diesel Force Emission System Cleaner through the differential pressure sensor ports, the technician ensures any clogs are removed and readings remain accurate. After a total of approximately 45 minutes, the service is complete. Adapters are removed and the vehicle is ready to undergo a manual regeneration. During the regeneration process, the DPF's temperature will be raised to approximately 1100 degrees Fahrenheit. This will safely cook off the foam and soot scrubbed from the engine. With the service completed and the engine cooled, 
our mechanics are once again able to gain access to the emission system and show us the result. As before, we will begin by scoping the outlet side of this Packard MX-13's EGR cooler. As you can clearly see from the before and after, the dense foam has scrubbed this cooler down to polished metal. Similar results are seen in the EGR valve with the edges of the valve now being clearly visible. Now we are viewing the inlet side of the EGR cooler and we see a drastic reduction in caked on material. In many areas we are once again able to see polished metal. Finally, the exhaust side of the VGT has been scrubbed clean of all soot buildup. The technicians are once again separating the exhaust canister to allow inspection of the DOC and DPF. And once again, back to our scale. We see the DPF weighs in at 46 pounds, a half pound lighter than before the service. Our inspection scope was once again used to inspect the mesh within the Packard MX-13 DOC. With all the inspections complete, the mechanics are reassembling the entire emission system in preparation for a mandatory oil change. The addition of one gallon of Diesel Force Synthetic Oil Systems Cleaner per approximately 44 quarts of oil, along with a motor oil change, is necessary immediately following all Diesel Force EGR system cleaning services. In addition, all oil samples should be pulled from the vehicle prior to running the Diesel Force EGR system cleaning service. Now that the service process has been completed on this vehicle, we will go to the scan tool to see the final results. As you can see, the soot load is zero and the vehicle is clean and operating normally. This packed car MX-13 is ready to get back out on the road. Thank you for watching Diesel Force.